and see where we go. This is the new catalogue. Isn't it scrummy? Sorry, my cover's a little grubby. I've got to give it a clean. Normally, I um, bind the spiral binder. So I, I go to the shop and they cut it off just along the edge here and then put it into the wire binding. But I used to get it done at um, Office Outlet and Office Outlet are no more. And I have to find somewhere else in Lincoln to have it done. And with everything that's been going on, I just haven't bothered. So it is in this cup, in this little plastic covering. And here we go. And at last, I can show you the inside pages. Super exciting. So this is the catalog cover. And you can see here, as soon as you open it, look at all this inspiration you've got. And all these goodies. And you can see here on this page, gives all um, the CEO of our company is Sarah and this lady here is Shelley and she started stamping up and you can see some of all of our lovely colours here and so many pretties. There are no kits in the catalogue because you will find them all online from the beginning of June you will be able to go online onto my online shop and you'll find all the kits. I've seen what the, the kits myself and they are scrum diddly umptious so we are definitely going to be doing some kits um, some kits as classes and initially it's going to be here online I might continue to be um, you know might continue to do that um, I will continue to do online classes even when things go back to normal because um, some of the people who attend classes are in London and I'm in Lincoln so this is just a great way of lots of people being able to come so let's start the, there are a number of what's called sweets in the catalogue. Now, sweets are where you have a number of coordinating products. For example, here you've got a stamp set, you've got dies, and you've got paper. And off the top of my head, yes, you've also got an embossing folder. So you've got all these bits that make up the sweet. And this is the first one. This is one I've actually bought and I've done a project with this already. And it'll come up on my blog shortly. And... <clears throat> You've got the tree and then you've got all these different two-step stamping for the tops and you can see here all the different things you can do so and you've got the matching paper to me this has a very autumn um, feel to it but you could use it all the time now as you can see I've got these little catalog tabs on my catalog here and they go for all the different areas so of the catalog and these are from Stampin Up now these don't come with the catalog there's something extra and if you place an order with me in May, you will get a, a set of these catalogue tabs for free. So, one good reason to order. So, you can see here we've had a number of carried over products. There was the Seascape. I have to say, anything fishy in sea doesn't really appeal to me. But, you know, each to their own. Yeah, I love these tree tabs too, Chris. They're gorgeous. Art Gallery, one of my favourite sets. That's carried over, so I'm pleased. Again, this one's carried over. And of course, my sunflower that I love and done numerous projects with. Now, this one I'm really excited about. This is Days to Remember. Now, this I got on the pre-order and this allows us to make our own little calendars. So if you're into planners, which I really am, I love my planners and all that sort of organising and, and um, you know, all the organisers and planners and all sorts of stuff like that. Um, this is great and we're going to be using this later in the year to make some little um, planners and diaries and calendars for next year and all sorts. It's a great way to give gifts as well. Again, some things that are carried over. And you can see actually quite a few things carried over from the other catalogue, which I'm really pleased about because sometimes it can be quite disheartening when things retire too quickly and you know you've got a limited budget and you're wanting to sort of take your time to buy the things you like and then you find it's retiring and you just haven't got enough money to buy everything you want um, and it's nice and some things quite a few things are carried over and it gives you a bit more time to budget and sort yourself out so I'm really pleased about that so you can see here again everything that I've got here as you can see it's highlighted in yellow is stuff I've got yeah I've got too much I know <laughs> okay and anything with asterisks the things i wanted to maybe buy so this is one of the sets i've just got this is stitchery and i like this because this is, makes lovely little borders around your your um images and i always think that um you know cards are no different to artwork they look so much better when they're nicely framed 
you know and this just gives a nice little frame around them a nice little border and it just helps to focus the eye in if you've got a border around something it just focuses your eye into the set into the focal image so i really like um things with the borders so i got that again this carried over again not my cup of tea but you know that that is very much me i'm not into the, really into the seaside in a big way it's like me you know people think the ideal summer holiday is going to sit on the beach in the sun and you know baking out in the sun and sun and getting you know a suntan and that yeah, doesn't do anything for me i'm much happier um climbing around you know looking at historic buildings you know going for a long walk that kind of thing not sitting on the beach <laughs> but there you go this is a favorite of mine this is the pansy patch and it is a two-step well it's going to be more than two steps i did about three or four steps in this and i made a couple of cards with this set and the gorgeous matching paper and dies and this is one suite we are using now in may car club so May Car Club will happen on the 19th of May and booking for that ends on Friday. And yes, we'll be using this definitely because the dies for here are actually cut out. As you can see, the images in the paper. So I really like it. And as you know, I'm a sucker for anything floral. I love my florals. I love, love anything floral. I love my flowers. Most of the pictures I take are all flowers. This is another set I'm thinking of getting. I haven't got it yet. It's called What's Cooking Bundle and I like it. You've got the little measuring cups and um, Susie Salt and Percy Pepper and all the implements. And I think this is going to be great for, I want to make a recipe binder later in the year as a class. And I think, you know, I don't know what you think, whether you think this is something you'd enjoy doing a recipe um, class here with a set like this where you make your own little recipe cards and a little binder to keep them in for all your favourite recipes. Okay. And again, these are my kind of thing, these lovely big, bold sentiments. They make for an easy, simple card, as you can see in this glorious, all these lovely um, samples they've given us. Again, this is one that has coming. And of course, my lovely tulips are carried over, which I'm very happy about, since I'm my favourite flower. So, again, you've got some lovely sentiments, you know. Thank you for all the little things you do and for your big heart. I know we've been out of touch, but I think about you more than other, more often than you know. Oh, it's so sweet. It's so kind. So one thing I love about Stampin' Up! is the sentiments. They're just really special. This is lovely. I've just been reading a message from a friend who's, who's going through a bit of a hard time, and this is just very true. Sometimes we can't do it alone. That's why I'm here for you. And that's what I wrote to her and said, if I can help in any way, just let me know. Um, because we are, we should be, be here for each other. That's, that's, that's why we're here, you know. And this is also true, I think, for everyone to remember. You are strong, brilliant and beautiful. We all are brilliant and beautiful and strong. We all have our, we all have things we're very good at. We all have our talents. We all have something positive we need to remember that because i think we focus on the negative too much um you know we will just keep thinking of the negative but if we pollyanna style focus on the positive you will surely find it you know anyway enough of that let's look at stamps our strawberries are carried over which i'm very happy about when i lived in london because as you know i'm <laughs> born and bred a londoner i'm very proud to say and I moved from London to Lincoln in 2016. And when I was in London, quite often every year, we'd go to the Chelsea Flower Show. And there was a chap there who always brought every year his strawberries. I think it was Ken Muir. And I have a ton of pictures of his strawberries from every year. And I want to do a scrapbook page about it with this, this stamp set. Because I think it'll just look so cute. Now, this one's another suite called In the Wild. And again, this appeals to me a lot because, as you might know, my maternal grand, my mother, my maternal side, all, all my mother's family are from South Africa. And um, so this really appeals to me, this paper here that you've got here, where you've got all the different wild cats and the big cats. And we actually, when I was small, went to um, we went to the Kruger National Park and I saw, I've seen all the wild cats and elephants and wildebeest and impala and lions, etc. in the you know 
in their natural habitat and I've got pictures and stuff so I think this will be lovely for that kind of thing and certainly for for me it just it really reminds me of home <laughs> and then we've got some more here this is lovely set for a man yeah this seems to me more American baseball caps I don't know maybe it's just me I like this set I haven't got it but I love this image here it reminds me of the Alhambra in in um in spain i don't know why but it does okay there's quite a few masculine sets in this in this in this in this catalog now which is great i don't really have any need to give a masculine card but if you do there's a lot here like these ties and bow ties it's really useful this is a set i've um denied and i still haven't got it this one of the trees because I got the other tree set but I like the sentiments wishing you all the beautiful gifts of Christmas it's your time to be remembered to feel appreciated and to know you're celebrated I, I really you know sheltering with love at all time when words fall short sending healing thoughts your way I really really like this and I think you know this is what's going to sway me to getting it we'll see and then we've got here, I, I've got this one, I love Mr. Fox, fantastic Mr. Fox. And I'm so grateful our doggies and kitties have kept. And yes, this one's coming, this one's coming for me. Aren't they cute? They're so cute. I have two cousins in South Africa and um, they're both expecting, um, one of them in August and one of them is only in a month's time, expecting it's going to be, one's a little boy and one's a little girl, so... This is lovely. I want to scrapbook the photos. I'd love to send them a card, but sending a card from here to South Africa is just a no-no. It's going to cost um, half a dozen arms and 6,000 legs, as I normally say. Um, it's just so expensive. And the post where my family is is so erratic that I've always said to my aunt, can't I send, can't I send you uh, a card? And she says, just doesn't get the post. You know, post might, you might send something and three or four months later it might turn up, it might not. It's not a good thing, unfortunately. Yes, Chris, I love the sentiments. Yeah, you're right. So here are my little turtles, which I think is adorable. And then these little kitty winks again, going into space. I just love. I'm going to really enjoy colouring these with my alcohol markers. And then... Look at the little pirate. Now, I'm going to show my age, but when I was a kid, there was a pirate called Captain Pugwash. And this reminds me of Captain Pugwash. Um, I think I still got the book somewhere. I don't know where. I think they're in a box in the garage somewhere, but I remember Captain Pugwash. And then if you've got bed, this is, again, it's a lovely set for children, if you've new babies. And then this, I think, has to be one of my favourite new sets in the catalogue, is Peach. I love it. It has paper, little mini jam jars. Um, it has everything you could wish for. Stamp set, dies, the whole katootles. I love it. Um, as you might know, my mother was born on a farm. My grandparents are farmers. They've had peaches on the farm. This is really something that's close. My grandmother used to make jam. Um, it's one of my favourite um Memories of childhood is having my granny's jam. She used to make, not peach, she'd made peach jam, but the one I used to love was fig jam. She always made fresh fig jam. Oh, it was beautiful. It was, it's a special memory. So I really like this and I love the, the way they've coloured these in. It all just speaks to me. And you can see here, they give you the colours that are in each suite. So here's Calypso Coral, Pale Papaya, now, another thing to say is in South Africa, we don't say papaya, we say pawpaw. So this is pale pawpaw to me. Manga Melody, Bumblebee, Pear Pizzazz and Marmy Blue. And now I was just watching team training with my upline, Amanda Fowler, and she was commenting on this stamp set. And I have to agree with it. It's one of a great steps. Lovely, big, bold sentiments. Easy, simple cards. You can have lovely pattern paper and then these simple sentiments on top and you're ready with a card. And then some more here. Hey, birthday chick. This again didn't appeal to me, but this has been a very popular set. Um, very happy this carried over. Look at the puffins. This is adorable. 
these are really nice for making small cards like three by three cards really useful for something like that then you've got this lovely punch here let's get on because i know i'm taking time this is another nice set as you can see here again, some lovely fray, you know, sentiment sets. Um, Peonies carried over. So again, and here you can see here not the sentiment set carried over. All night, thanks. Um, this is a new set again with a new punch that I've just started to use, which is really nice. This, I think, is a lovely set. I, I like this image here. It's a carried over one, but it's a lovely image here, I think. This, I don't know, this one, this, this, this is very Mediterranean in feel, this one here. Um, again, it's a sweet. And again, you've got, you've got paper, dyes, um, you know, embellishments, stamps, etc. This one I loved, Count on Me. I have a friend who's into penguins, and this is just her. Be lovely of card for her. And I just love these little two koalas here saying, No matter what, I'm here for you. They're so cute. And I like this as well, them on the tandem here. I don't know if you remember a song from years ago in the, in, in the UK. Daisy, Daisy, give me your answer too. This reminds me of them. It won't be a stylish marriage. I can't afford a carriage, yeah, but you'll look sweet. Oh, so I love that on a bicycle made for two. You've got Badgy Besties. These are cute again. These again are perfectly sized for um, three by three cards or for tags. Really cool. And then we have Christmas in the catalogue, which I am so pleased there's Christmas in the catalogue. Definitely. Never too early for Christmas. And with the weather we're having at the moment, you wouldn't know that it's meant to be coming into May. You'd think we're at Christmas, so let's go for it. <laughs> so here we have nice stockings again, a matching die set. It's a suite again called the Tidings of Christmas Suite. And you've got paper, you've got ribbon, um, stamps and dies. This is a large stamp, so it's not shown at... This is only shown at... Um, 60% of the image. This is the actual size here at 100%. So just remember that. Some of the images here aren't always at um, the actual size you find them in the catalogue. In real life, they're not the size, so you need to watch out where it tells you. This is a nice set. This is a lovely sentiment again. May the beauty of the season bring you joy and warm memories to cherish throughout the years. And we have poinsettias carrying over, which I'm very, very pleased about. Now, I was just talking to my um, upline and she's saying she loves this set here, artistically inked. And again, it's a suite with paper, ephemera, dies and stamps. And you can see the ephemera there. Again, a new set here. The best part of this will be the dies up. I'll show you in a minute. I'm glad this carried over because I love this script stamp here. This is really good for, I do a lot of mixed media and this is great for mixed media. Hand pen, this is lovely. Again, this is sweet with gems, dyes, paper, stamps. And this is the other suite we're gonna be using in my May car club. So do check out that car club and you'll be using this then. And as you can see, our butterfly stamp is carried over. And we also have this lovely daisy, which again is much smaller than it normally is. It's only showing you half the size that it normally is. Hydrangeas are carried over. And you can see another suite called the Sweet Symmetry. And it has this matching punch and paper and ribbon and all sorts of good stuff. And you can see here. Art in Bloom, I'm really great, glad for this. This is a lovely set, I think. I like the two-step stamping. These are our big stamps, as I call them, our background stamps, and you can see quite a few have carried over. 
So that's all the stamps. Yeah, there are a lot, aren't there? Now we're going to move on quickly to some other stuff. These are the ring colours. For a fresh freesia, polished pink, evening evergreen, soft succulent, pale purple. Now I should say at this point, I did a whole video showing you all new in colours and all the stuff I got from my, my pre-order in April. Um, and I'll link that below. So there is a whole vid, there is a video showing you all the um, colours in more detail and everything. So that is available. This is our stamp and storage. And you can see here again, this is one thing I want to point out is we've got some new colouring medium. And this is soft pastels. So the soft pastels um, are an assortment pack. And you're going to get eight different colours. So you've got Coastal Cabana, Daffodil Delight, Gorgeous Grape, Granny Apple Green, Mago Melody, Mossy Meadow, Night of Navy and Purple, Purple, Poppy Parade. So I'm really excited to have a play with those. I've ordered those today. And here you've got all your scrapbooking stuff, your memories and more. And here's all the sort of the, the basics of crafting. Your embossing powders, heat tool, embossing paste. Um, we've got a new set of decorative stencils that come out. And this is all our normal stuff. We've got our Versamark and everything that's normal. Here's all our paper. So you can see a lot of this we've already seen in the suites as we've gone through. Um, you can see here, this In Good Taste has actually carried over from the last catalogue. This one I didn't get, but it's a nice set. It has actually, if it, it has, a, has copper, gold and silver foiling. So if foiling is your thing, then definitely have a look and check out that paper. That's the Simply Elegant. And here we've got our new designs for our in colours and our family stacks, as I call them, for the 6 by 6 little packs. And again, I showed you these... Um, the new in colours family paper in that whole video that I talked about. Then you've got some little extra bits of paper here, extra bits like pearlescent speciality paper, foil sheets, doilies. We've got some lovely, I should point out here, the shimmer vellum. And these are actually 12 by 12 sheets of vellum in all the ring colours. And I think, you know, they look gorgeous. I love these little, these flowers that they've actually made out of them. I think they're lovely. And here you've got your basics, your window sheet, your envelopes and all that sort of good stuff. And here's packaging. So uh, acetated card boxes have continued, which I'm very happy about. And here's gorgeous ribbon. As you can see, I wanted most of it. <laughs> um, some things are carried over, some are new. I showed you all our new in colour ribbon in that video. Embellishments. Again, I showed you some of this already in the video. And here you can see all our lovely embellishments. One thing is unlike here, we've got some in-colour square gems, which are these ones here. That's in black and white, which I'm really, and some rounds, which I'm really happy to have brows back because they just allow you to do some extra techniques. And if you don't know what these are, these are shaker shapes. So these are great. You get 675 pieces in here and these will be great for making your shaker pockets with like here your mason jars um, and I'm glad these have carried over these pastel pearls because they are simply gorgeous they carried over from the mini stamper artist enough said best stamping tool ever you'll see me using it six zillion times in my videos same as my simple chamois I could not live without my simple chamois to clean my stamps punches now we did lose some punches and i was very upset about that but we've got some gorgeous new ones and i do love my punches um to just find them so easy to use and so quick i really am a punch girl so you've got your dragonflies your elegant tag these new ones evergreen border i love this border of trees i think that's so cool this new flower and leaves punch this is symmetrical stems border punch Look at the turtle punch, you're good. So, and then we've got a lot of punches that are carried over. As you can see, our cat, our hearts. These are all our scoring tools and cutting tools, which hasn't changed. You've got the embossing machines, which I've showed you before. I think I've showed you. Here's the mini boss machine. Really, really easy to use. As you can see, it is so nice and light. I can hold it with one finger. Really lovely machine 
I'm very happy with that. Okay. Embossing folders. Um, a lot of these are the 3D ones that give you really nice texture. Um, so I'm really pleased about that. Some great ones carried over, like the painted texture. Um, I can't wait till you see this one. This is called Macrame. I think it's going to give a really nice textured background as well. Um, and the dies. So the first part of the dies is called, called die bundles. So these are all where you have a bundle. So you have stamps and dies together and you get 10% off. Why not? And um, so these are all of our bundles. And we've seen them already as we went through the catalogue. Um, this one here is one I loved. I like all these different um, rectangles and um, especially this little scallop piece here that's going to create this border. I think that's going to be so useful. Um, so you can see here all of our lovely bundles. There's more to come. You can see here, here's the cooking one that I said to you I really think will be great for uh, to make a recipe album. And you've got a lovely Christmas one here with the stocking. And here's the big cats. And things like this where you've got this large cat, you don't have to just use it to cut out the die, the stamp. You could just use it like this as a silhouette. You could actually take your blending brushes and colour in the image with your blending brushes and then put it against a black background. And that would look really cool as well. Now these are just dies that don't have um, a bundle or they maybe do match a stamp set but they're not being sold as a bundle. Um, this border style here is going to be so useful and again you're going to see this in the next car club. Um, what else is new? This give it a whirl. This will make a slight um, a spinning card you know that spins along the side and as you spin it on the side a new image appears. I'm not great at trying to explain but let's see if there's an image here I can explain. Yeah here you see as you spin this piece here at the side something else will pop up in this window and this is the die set that will allow that so we'll be using this in a future car club i've ordered this today for definite okay and here more dies we've got dies for here there and everywhere and in between as well um i've got this one as well a picture of this which is a nice die and i'm going to show you some samples with this here I like this look. It cuts out all these little windows like this so you can have little critters popping through uh, like they've used these ones here but you could have the little ping, little um, puffins poking through. It would be lovely. And more dies and adhesive and you can never have too much adhesive. Never ever 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 too much adhesive says I. And that is the end of our catalogue. Except for this last page, which is the hostess points. Now, if you have a party or if you kind of, you know, if your order is more than £150, you get what's called free hostess um, benefits. And so, for example, if you have a £150 party or an order, you'll get 10% stamp and rewards, which is equivalent to about £15 worth of free product. And these, are, you can choose anything in the catalogue, but these are lower priced, so you can get the maximum amount of your... 15 pounds so you've got here paper and some stamp sets and all sorts you know so really nice so that's that so that is the new catalog if you have any questions just get hold of me i really love it and i hope you are going to as well i think it's so much fun and joy and i really love crafting it really just it makes me happy so thank you for watching as I said, if you do order in May, you will get a copy, um, a set of these little gorgeous little tabs for free. And do, don't forget to check out Car Club. That's going to close now on Friday, the 7th of May. Um, and we'll host in here in the group on the 19th. So as I said, we'll be using all new product from this catalogue. So thank you again and thank you for attending my launch and take care. And until next time, enjoy being creative. Bye.